What is going on guys? Fishing a little pond today, like usual I know. Um, water's really high so hopefully it's got them fish pushed up shallow. It's about 85 degrees today so it's awesome weather. Hopefully they're up spawning. But we're gonna get out there, get the flipping sticks out, get the frog, maybe catch some on that. So we're gonna get out there and hopefully get a few in the boat. All right. Water looks awesome, it's so high up in these weeds. Hoping it's a good day, just got a little flipping weight. Quarter or three eighths ounce, I don't remember exactly, just a little black and blue beaver bait. But I think that should do the trick. Just a little male looks like, but it's probably what a lot of them will be. Just hoping the females are up too, so I might get a chance at a bigger one. What I like to do when I do get a bite in a certain spot, especially if it's a male, I like to go back to that same spot and fish it a little bit more just in case there's a female hanging around. Never know. Just like that, actually. <laughs> Almost positive they're up on beds. You can tell by their tails. They're up there spawning, so... If I get one, definitely going to try that same spot again for another, just like that. I know there's some giants in here, so... They're spawning like that, it's just a matter of time. Oh my gosh. Had one right there, took me in the stick. Oh. Darn. was in there again, wrapping me around the logs. That was another nice one. Got him. <laughs> there we go. There we go. Don't know if that's the same fish, but If it was, he was hungry. <laughs> they really could be anywhere along this whole bank since it's so flooded like this. There's really good structure anywhere, or everywhere, I should say. So, just kind of got to decide if I'm going to actually flip all this or I might kind of pick up the frog and just fish it a little bit quicker over some of the spots.
Got one right here. See if he eats this or not. <laughs> uh, just a little bugger. Just a little male. Frog was a little too big for him. How is there not one there? You all right? There was one there. I think I hooked him. Try to bite again. Maybe. Maybe, maybe. Hit it. Eat it. Golly. All right, well, he doesn't want the frog. I know he's got to be here yet. In fact, I see a log. I think he's on. There we go. Third time's a charm. They don't all eat the frog right away, but you can usually get them with the old flipping bait if they miss it, so works out. Wow, he choked it. <laughs> He's kind of pissed off. Black frog, only color you need. size 65 just walking it back and forth real short especially when it's fairly early yet for the frog bite so I really like to keep it moving but yet not progressing forward as much as I can just so they get a good look at it and I don't know they usually eat it pretty good so that's about all I'm doing you know, you know, really.
freaking crushed it. Smoked frog. Well guys, I think we're going to end it there. Sun's going down. Not sure how many fish I caught, but to be honest, it was better than I thought it probably would be. But um, just remember, if you guys are fishing some dirty or stained water this spring, shallow grass like this that's all kind of submerged, all you need is a black frog, and a little Texas rig crawdad or creature bait. I like black and blue, but it seems to show up the best in this dirty water. So. Those two baits are pretty much what I caught them all on today. Um, thanks again for watching guys and we'll see you on the next one.